Hello, happy Valentine's Day everyone. I hope you have something super fun planned. But anyway, like the uh, little thumbnail said, um, I'm going to be sharing with you the best pink and like a Valentine's Day themed makeup. None of this is new, so this is probably stuff that you might already have and maybe some looks that you can create. Anyway, so if you'd like to see my choices for the best Valentine's Day makeup and makeup looks, then please keep on watching. Just so you know, I do upload a daily video all about budget beauty, so make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. I also do a live stream the first Sunday of the month at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so make sure you come and hang out with me, come chat. I love getting to know my viewers and subscribers. Okay, so I am kind of on the fence with pink makeup sometimes. Sometimes I feel like I, I can pull it off, and sometimes I don't. But I wanted to share with you um, my favorite palettes, lipsticks, um, some stuff like that, that have like a beautiful pink shade. It can be like light to dark, bold, whatever. So yeah. So pink makeup can be really, really pretty and easy to do. It all just depends on your comfort level. I absolutely love doing a pink eyeshadow with a bold lip or with a bold wing. Or you can also just do a pink lip and just a plain eye. It's really up to you. But yeah, let's get into this. Okay, so if you're a little bit, you know, unsure about pink makeup like I was, then I one of my best suggestions would to it would be to focus on the cheeks or lips. Um, I think that's a lot easier for a lot of people um, just to do like lips and cheeks in a pink shade. So my favorite pink like face palettes, first one would be the Beauty Treats Halo Glow Face Palette. And it is so, so pretty. Lots of beautiful pink shades. Even this highlighter kind of goes, has kind of a little pinky shift to it. But really, really pretty. It is cruelty free. And you get quite a few different blushes and highlighters. I mean, just so, so pretty. If you look at this, and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is just screaming over it to me. But that, that pink blush, so, so pretty. So yeah, a beautiful pink flush on the cheeks and with minimal makeup can look totally beautiful. It's a nice way to incorporate a little bit of pink into your makeup. Another one is the LA Girl Spice. Um, this is the blush palette. And so pretty tame, pretty kind of desaturated, but once again, these two blush shades, so, so pretty, very, very soft, pigmented, but not overly so. But once again, just a really nice way to get a nice flush of pink, and it can really add to your look. So these are my two favorite face palettes when it comes to pink blush, pink highlighters, stuff like that. So definitely recommend these. Favorite pink lipsticks, lip glosses, whatever. First one would have to be the e.l.f. Everyday, um, sorry, this is the e.l.f. Runway Ready Pink Kisses Lip Palette. I know not all of us are into lip palettes. I'm getting into them more, but this one has every shade of pink that you could ever want. So hot pink, baby pink, it's just a nice way to Start experimenting with some pink lip shades, sorry. This is still sealed, but I actually gave this palette um, to my mother-in-law a couple years ago, but it does come with a lip brush. But once again, very, very creamy and pigmented. I mean, really, really nice pink lipstick shades. But once again, you got like a really pale baby pink all the way to like that hot pink to that red pink. Once again, just a really nice way to incorporate a little bit of pink into a look. Okay, um, I'm just going to go ahead and I guess swatch these right here. Another really great one, and this is from um, Sigma. This is their Pink Lip Eclipse, and this is in the shade Sigma Pink. And... This is kind of like a mix between like a lip gloss and a lipstick, so it's almost like a lip vinyl, but super pretty, super vibrant, really, really nice. So yeah, like I was saying in that little voiceover part, a bold pink lip and like just a little bit of winged liner, little some lashes or something can totally amp up that look so fast. 
Okay, so lipsticks, lip liner, I even have a lip balm, so the cover, or I'm oh, sorry, I'm having a rough day today, if you couldn't tell. The Wet n Wild Pout and Shock, and this is in the shade Shock, and it's just a really pretty light pink tinted lip balm. But once again, it's going to be for those individuals that aren't really into makeup or they're into something more sheer, less colorful on the lips. Really, really nice though. You can pair it with their with the Wet n Wild um, gel liner, and this is in the shade Pink Electro. Really, really beautiful electric pink shade. Fill your lips in with this, and then top it with that lip balm. Stunning, absolutely stunning. Another Wet n Wild. I just really like Wet n Wild lip products. It is their Burella shade, um, matte lipstick, and once again, this is just. It's a beautiful rosy pink, not too bright. It's not bordering hot pink yet, but really, really nice. Um, then I have a very muted pink, and this is for people that just want to dip their toe in just a little bit. This is the um, Maybelline um, Super Stay Matte Ink in Lover. This is so pretty. It is a very, very, like I said, muted pink. It's kind of like a nude and a pink mixed together, like a dusty pink. But once again, it's just giving you giving you enough pink to show that like, hey, it's date night, hey, it's Valentine's, without going super far in. So really, really beautiful pink shade for the lips. Okay, so if you are comfortable with pink lipstick and pink blush and highlighter um, and you want to start getting into some eyeshadow. I got some shadow palettes to share with you. Um, okay, so this is like one of my favorites and it's so freaking cheap. It is the LA Colors Stylish and it's a cute little palette. But if you see here, there's a lot of pink shades in this corner. Pigmented, easy to blend, and there's enough neutral shades in here that you could totally um, do a nice neutral look with like a pop of pink like a dark brown on the outer corner and then going ahead and going in with a pink shimmer really really beautiful really really easy and it's just nice and it's a dollar so definitely recommend that another really affordable palette this is the uh, wet n wild this is from their rose collection um, but this is in the shade bed of roses and this is pink but you're bordering onto that rustiness so it's going to be a little bit deeper a little bit grungier a little bit more goth but once again with the way that these colors play together so so pretty i just i love this palette as well it's like a rose gold pink Another really great, sorry, I gotta start putting stuff down, okay. So, um, once again, a really nice Wet n Wild. This is the Starlux Eyeshadow Quad, and this is in the shade I don't know. Oh man, I don't see the color name on here. Oh, let's go Astrophysical. So, once again, pretty neutral, but this shade right here is pretty rosy. You have um, this really pretty rosy pressed glitter, and even this really pretty shimmer. It's got a pink shift to it. Super affordable, especially right now. It's probably on sale because it was a holiday collection, so but really, really nice. And it's just got that touch of pink, so really, really nice. Okay, so we're starting to get into a little bit pricier palette. So the Profusion Love Struck. Once again, big palette, but this whole entire middle row right here, you got the pinks, you got the purples, that beautiful pink pressed glitter. If you're a little bit more adventurous, you could do like a beautiful cut crease and then like tap this on over it. So, so pretty. And this is about $10, so you get a lot of shades. I believe there's 35 in here. Yep, 35 shades, and it's just absolutely stunning. 
Okay, second to last. This one, once again, has a lot of shades. Um, this is from um, Eloise um, Cosmetics. I got this in my BoxyCharm when I tried it out again. But once again, a lot of people get BoxyCharm. A lot of people probably got this palette. But we got a lot of beautiful hot pink shades. Some nice um, shimmer shades. Like that shimmer. This matte. Just stunning. And then the priciest palette that I personally paid for, and this is probably the most pink, this is the Juvia's Place Berries palette. No, it sounds like it's going to be purpley. And it's a little bit purpley, but... Ah! Dropping things. Um, look at those beautiful hot pink mattes. So, so pretty. Absolutely love this palette. I haven't gotten to play with around with it very much, but it is very, very pigmented. And I love Juvia's Place eyeshadows, so. Yeah, and a lot of people probably have this as well. You can create a really, really beautiful look, even if you want it to be neutral on the top of the eye and then smoke out a little bit of pink on the bottom lash line. You can totally do that. Um, and then lastly, let me show you what Sean got me for Valentine's Day, because I know a lot of people are probably curious. So, um, so, so sweet of him, and I haven't, I've used this palette, but I haven't used the other one, I'll show you. But he got me the ColourPop Garden Variety Palette. This is really, really beautiful. It's kind of like a nice pastel -y one. Super cute. And then he also got me, which this blew my mind, he got me the ColourPop Stone Cold Fox eyeshadow palette, which I haven't even swatched this one, so I need to do that soon, but it looks stunning. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I know it was a little bit different, but um, I didn't want to do like a, a hot pink look because I didn't think people would be interested in that, but maybe just showing you probably still have stuff in your collection maybe you forgot about, maybe you don't realize are pink toned, and if you want to do a stellar look this afternoon or this evening for Valentine's Day, you already have what you need in your collection. Maybe you got some ideas on how to apply pink makeup, whether it's just going to be the lips, the cheeks, or the eyes, or all of it, because I've done that, as you saw on some of those photos, um, I've done a totally pink monochromatic look, and it's fun, and you just got to go with it, but anyway, there we go. Um, I hope you did enjoy today's video. If you did, please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up and share it. Let me know down below in the comments what are your plans for this evening, what fun things are you going to do. Sean and I are going to be eating popcorn and playing Mad Libs, because we're a married couple, and that's what you do. So anyway, um, I will have as much as I can find linked down below for you. It will be an Amazon affiliate link. You're welcome to use it, but you definitely don't have to. Um, I also will have my Macari page where I sell discount makeup, beauty, skincare, hair care, all sorts of stuff that will be down below, as well as my other YouTube channel where I upload seven days a week, all about budget food, and my Facebook group where we kind of hang out and chat and post our good deals and stuff. So yeah, check out down below. And of course, you're always welcome to follow me on my other social media, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's all a bunch of glam, babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start auto-playing here very shortly. Or you can always click on one of the ones that'll be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.